I have decided to stick with love. Hate is too great a burden to bear. Those are the famous words of Dr. Martin Luther King. And today they were once again front and center to remember uh, how far we've come and what has yet to be accomplished. The legacy of a civil rights icon was not just a day off work, but a way for many to reflect on a man who still inspires us today. Now, the theme of uh, this year's celebration of the legacy of Dr. King is the, uh, the living the maladjusted life always putting others first. The University of Arkansas in Fayetteville and Fort Smith were forced to go virtual due to recent COVID case spikes, but the commemoration went unabated. At UAFS, a morning panel discussed how many of their nonprofits, such as the Crisis Stabilization Unit, puts others first in Fort Smith. We've provided um, immediate emergency treatment for a lot of people in the community so that people don't have to wait in the emergency room so long to be placed. And in Springdale, a parade open to all stirred remembrance and raised awareness. Organizers say the fifth annual event makes them proud to be residents of Northwest Arkansas. It was so amazing to see our community come together and stand in solidarity to celebrate the legacy of Dr. King, to just love on each other and to just want better for everyone. Whether in person or virtual, the point was not missed. America has come a long way due to one man's bravery, legacy and inspiration. When he got assassinated, um, he was in Memphis, you know, fighting for the sanitation workers, you know. Dr. King was about love. He was just about love and strength all the way across the board, together, 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 right? Uh, MLK events at UAFS continue through the week. A virtual fireside chat scheduled for Friday, focusing on mental health. And through Thursday, campus is holding a school supply drive to honor Dr. King's commitment to education. Live at home in Rogers, Paul Petit, 4029 News.